By default, all maps will use the Plains tile set when first created. This is a 128 by 128 pixel PNG image file stored in the tileset folder. If you want to add new sprites to the tileset, but do not have enough space, you can increase the dimensions of the file so long as the new dimensions are a multiple of 16. This is because each sprite is allowed to use 16 pixels of space. For example, you can use the dimensions 128 by 256, as both numbers are divisible by 16. If you want to use a new custom PNG file for your tileset, you must first add it to your database. Click on the Data Manager icon in the upper left part of your screen. Then in the new window, click on the last tab titled Tilesets. Click on the plus symbol next to the Set Max to make a new tileset. Select your new tileset and give it a name. Now click on the picture icon next to the text box near the top of the Data Manager window. This will open a new window where you can upload your custom tileset. Select from the list of image files, then click the arrow key next to the refresh button. Your custom tile set will become selectable. Select it and press OK. In the practicable tab, select the sprites you don't want NPCs to walk through, such as trees or rocks. Now click on the directions tab right next to the practical tab, and repeat the process. The white arrows indicate whether an NPC can walk over it when drawn on the floor. So click the center button if you want to remove the ability to walk over them. After you finish selecting the sprites that NPCs can't walk over or through, select your new tileset from the tilesets list and select OK. Now right click your selected map and choose Edit Map Properties. In the new window, assign your new tileset from the tileset drop down menu and press OK. Your custom tileset is now ready for use. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel, or leaving a comment down below. This has been Sid from Digital Container, and I hope to see you next time.